And for our next bout, please welcome to the blue corner, representing Sabai D Muay Thai Gym, Romain Gil. And please welcome to the red corner, representing Brooks Gym in Hitchin, Jabit Kula! And this Pro-Am Muay Thai rules bout takes place in the minor 61 kilogram division over three two-minute rounds. All right, lads, come centre for us. All right, lads, we're going through the rules early. Both understand, yeah? Knees to the head are allowed, yeah? Okay? Make sure you listen to me. Follow my instructions, all right? Okay, best of luck. Touch gloves. All right, here we go. <coughs> Pro M. <coughs> Three rounds, two minutes. 61 Three kilos. In a row. Really nice with Jabin. We're going to see some good Muay Thai in this one, some good scoring. Some good one for one, tip for tap. Three rounds, you have to kind of go out a little bit faster, a little bit quicker. There's no feeling out process. No. So, as you can see, elbows are loud. Good boxing from Romain. Good kick block, nice strong jab from Romain. Jab and staying relaxed, good catch of the leg, nice. goes straight to the clinch. Good strong knee. head position. Good knee. Yeah, Solid nice. work, he was going to dump it there as well. Good defense with Roman. Romain, sorry. I'd like to see more than a leg kick from Jabbit. That's all he seems to do. Maybe this is his first round of feeling out as such. But as, as we just said, there's only three rounds. Yeah, you don't want to be taking too many of those either. Strong punch, good push kick. Remains looking really good. He's looking really strong at the moment. 
in control. Trying to get a sneaky elbow in off the clinch. Attempted it, unfortunately, uh, Jabib saw it. But how's he gonna counter that? How's he gonna react back to it? Remain is just the more aggressive fight. Keeps pushing Jabib back constantly. The more aggressive, always going first. Good cross from Jabib, but there's no follow-up. It's one shot done. Yeah, I'd like to see more from Jabib. Nice. Caught that kick, good return. There we go, end of round one. Nice work, let's see what they do for round two. Here we go, round two. Round two, box. Said to say, very technical so far. Yeah, not too aggressive, but it's playful, it's skillful. Nice, strong punches there, block though. Jabbit relying on that low kick. Maybe he knows a weakness. Yeah, it's all he's really been throwing and having success with, to be honest. Shoot up. Yeah, I think he tried to body there, but didn't have his distance as much. Jabin comfortable to stand in front of him and throw. He, doesn't, he has no respect for him. Look, yeah, Ramesh is going to so stay there. The range is going to stay there and he's going to throw. Good check. Good Ramesh team. got really good punches and I like to see him utilize it now while he's keeping his opponent in yeah. the corner. Nice elbow there good at elbow. the top. First one thrown. Yep, and landed. Unless you remain to it back now. You're throwing so many hands, you might as well throw the elbow in after. Yeah, especially when they go in for that clinch, yeah. it's the perfect time to do it. Jabbed wearing a little bit of Romain's punches on his face now. This is where you need to keep him in that corner. Yeah. There you go, that's what you need to be doing. Oh. Good ring craft, just hold those ropes, lift <laughs> yeah. those legs up. It worked. Good team. Remain's extremely confident, just walking him down, heavy bombs, keep him, look, he keeps him at good range the whole time, never crowds his work. Yeah, keeping him on the ropes. Nice. Jabbit needs to get off the ropes, he needs to take control a little bit better. Yeah. I'd like to see Romain just to throw a kick at the end of the combination, it would just solidify the round for him. Yeah, you can see some swelling on the left eye yeah. there. He's definitely wearing those shots. A lot of the stuff is blocking, but it's, you know, it's still looking effective. He's in the yeah. corner. Nice, good push kick there. Nice. He looks like he's very... We need to see something from Jabin. I think he's two rounds down. Jabin is very back foot heavy. Yeah. He's spending all the time on the ropes or in the corner. Even now, he's not allowed to, not allowed to hold onto the ropes. I mean, even his counters aren't that great either. It's not like he's on the back of the ropes scoring massive counters. Strong punch in there for Roman. Yeah. 
I think that's the story of this fight. Good push kick, utilizing it well. Good cover up. Jabbit needs to be a little bit more fearless now. Throw some more shots, go forward, he's got to get that knockout. I mean, I don't think the knockout's going to come. In the clinch now. Keeping it active. Nothing too dangerous. Uh, Nothing too damaging from both boys. Okay, break. I mean, they're right. at the final minute. Last minute, that's it. Oh, he went, he went to throw the punch. Yeah. Nice switch. Good, nice knees. Yeah. Jabit doesn't want to be turning his back too much there. Nice. He's getting dominated. In yeah, he now. needs to be staying upright, He's staying strong up. Head position. All right, last 20 seconds. Neither boy is trying to look for that finish. No. Actually, oh, wow. as we said Beautiful. that, he is done. Three. That's that it. Was, that was a switch. He faked it. Yep. Jab cross. Hey, Caught him flush. Well done. Hey. I didn't think he was going to get back up from that. As I said it. Yep. Wow, there we go. Oh, that's how you finish a round. One ends to round three. Well done, my man. Well done. Let's have a big round of applause, please, for both of these men after three superb rounds. And at the end of those three completed rounds of action, we go to your judges' scorecards, where we have a unanimous decision, all in favor of your winner in the blue corner, Romain Gilbert. And show your appreciation for our brave runner-up, Javid Gulam.